A special day for Madison Ty, both on the field and away from it. And she joins us following a 2-1 victory over Wisconsin. Let's start with the match. You play your home opener today, and you get a late goal from one of the newcomers, Amber Munnerlin, to defeat a ranked Wisconsin team. How did you see it? Uh, we just, I mean, we get drilled about free kicks and set pieces and how important they are. And we just played a ball back in, and we had a great ball from Mac, and Amber just capitalized on, on it. So I know Lou, our assistant coach, is pretty stoked. She works pretty hard on our set pieces. So it's really exciting and awesome for Amber, getting her first goal as a Bruin. We're really happy to have her. You know, Madison, speaking of, you know, getting on the board with Munderland and a newcomer, how about you being dangerous on set pieces? Annie Alvarado took that one, did not put it inside the penalty area, to, but instead Gabby Miranda from way out. How often do you work on those, and what does that look like in practice? Um, you know, I can't, like, emphasize how much every time before pregame. It's like, we got to be dangerous on set pieces, and we they set this one up for Gabby, and Gabby just hit a killer shot, and it was really awesome, and it was, on the board it said, set up this play, and it said goal from Gabby, so it was awesome that she just um, finished it. Now, Madison, you have a special connection to the Wisconsin program. Your younger sister, Alexis, in town for this match. And before it, we celebrated hashtag D strong once again. What was the moment like to have your sister on the pitch with you as you remembered your mother, D Schmidt? Um, honestly, it's kind of, you can't really put it into words. Uh, the three of us were so close and to be able to uh, share our soccer with my sister and to be, um, remember my mom is pretty unforgettable and uh, really, really special. And I'm glad I got to share it with her soccer family and my soccer family. And it was, I'm really, really, really honored and blessed. We are part of last year in, in recognizing the month of October. Uh, when your mom was diagnosed and you guys were fighting through this together and of course you lose your mom in, in January but what do you remember most and what, what legacy does your mom leave with you as you kind of battle through life as a student athlete? Uh, she used to always say never never give up so I just every day try and live with that mentality and just keep going and plugging along and do what I do in school and academics and I'm surrounded by a really awesome athletic community at UCLA and I'm really lucky to have such an amazing soccer team to, to be supported by. You are carrying on a great tradition at center back for UCLA. Well done today. Congratulations on the win and most importantly thank you for letting us at Pac-12 Network be part of D-Strong. Thank you so much.